Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, we'll look at how to quickly create a new email group in Microsoft Outlook. Let's get straight into it. I'm logged into Microsoft and I'm in my Outlook inbox on the web. If you email the same group of people regularly, creating a new email group in Outlook to do that quickly is straightforward to do, but can be a little tricky if you haven't done it before. Let's look at how to do that in just five steps. I'll start by moving my mouse pointer to the far left bar in the Outlook inbox. There's a number of options here, but I'll select the people icon shown there. This opens the contacts section of Outlook, where you can create and manage all the contacts you use in Outlook. Let's now move on to step two and create our new email group or contact group as it's known in Outlook. We can do this by moving to the blue new contact button shown at the top of the inbox. Rather than creating a new contact, however, I'm going to move to the small drop down arrow to the right of that button and click on it once to select it. A few options are then shown, but we're interested in the new group link shown at the bottom. Let's choose that. A pop up box then appears, and we'll move on to step three of this guide name your contact group. I'll quickly add a name for my new email group. You can also choose to add a description for the group if you wish, but this is optional and can be left blank if you prefer. Once I'm happy with that, to confirm it, I'll click on the large blue create button. We can now move on to step four of the process. Add the members to the contact group. You'll see Outlook already suggests some of the contacts that I email regularly and you can just select any of them by moving your mouse pointer to their name and clicking on it once. Of course, you can also type the name of a contact if you know it, and Outlook may well suggest them if you've emailed that person in the past. You can select the person simply by pressing the return key, and they will then be added to your email contact list. In those situations where you want to add an entirely new contact, all you need to do is enter their full email address. And once you're happy it's correct, press the return key and that will also be added to your contact list. The final step in creating your new email group is to save it. Once I'm happy that my email is complete, I can do that simply by clicking on the blue add button at the bottom of that window. You'll see that our new email group has now been added to the group section of our contacts and I'm marked as the owner. To quickly send an email to that new group, all I need to do is click on the send email option shown at the top of this page. Outlook will then open a new blank email. You'll see that some numbers have been added to the group name we provided to make it more unique and give it its own email address. I hope you find this Woggle guide useful and learn something new. If you have, please like or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.